what I always intended Genius Garage to be from day one is a dream shot. Hello everyone, I'm Casey Putch, the founder and lead mentor of the Genius Garage Educational Programs. For the last number of years, we've done professional level road racing teams with college student engineers so they can get that incredible real world experience and augment their academic background and really kickstart their careers for the future. So this year for 2020, I think it's time we build a car from the ground up. And it's very exciting because we've got the Fast and the Furious live Lycan prop. Very exciting because it's exactly proportionally accurate to a Lycan Hypersport. So I think with a team of some of you all, we should go ahead and build an awesome performance machine with a Porsche basis, utilizing Porsche drivetrain, suspension and such. And it's gonna be very exciting. We've already making arrangements so that this car, not only will it be finished in 2020, we're gonna take it to SEMA. Very exciting show. And of course, planning some other exciting public things here in the future. We're gonna be doing a collaborative effort with the VinWiki channel. Of course, I'll be back to tell stories. Maybe we'll have some fun things going on with students having the opportunity to meet people, meet Ed, some mentors and uh, collaborative efforts going on with that. And of course, the opportunity to do this is just incredible because we can take some of the brightest and most driven young people who are going to school, potentially to be engineers, designers, maybe some of you out there looking to be a career mechanics or fabricators, some PR people, people in videography, photography, all want to be part of this team this year to do this car and uh, give you an opportunity to develop your portfolio, to develop your resume, but even more importantly, to grow as individuals, to come together as a team, to gain that confidence, to gain that experience, which is what industry is going to see when your resume ends up at the top of the pile. And so you all have the best opportunity to get jobs. So let's get right into what we're looking for in terms of students. Well, uh, obviously all young men and women are able to apply. You have to be 18 years of age or older, so a legal adult. There's uh, going to be different uh, positions relating to the team, of course. So I foresee there being a lot of young students that perhaps are already in engineering going through that. There's going to be some that maybe are looking to be a high-end mechanic in some way with mechanical skills or fabrication. Maybe they're coming from the trades. There's a possibility we'll also get some designers. Uh, and there's gonna be tremendous a lot of skills involved from those things. But beyond that, this is also an opportunity for people out there that are in business and or potentially communications uh, with a focus on photography and videography. Because along the way, we're going to document uh, with video, very exciting, all of the students' work. Our project together here at Genius Garage, our travels, our adventures, our difficulties, how we overcome them, and all of us as a team and all of the students as individuals. So we're gonna do that together because it's really the best way to do something big together. Now, in regard to this, a Genius Garage, of course, is in Ohio, in the United States. So, for the time being that the students are here, you will have to live in this area. Uh, that Genius Garage and me and everyone here, we go out to get the funding, effectively scholarships, so the students that get chosen for this program get to be part of it at no charge. Because that is very important for me as the founder to be able to choose people based on what's in their head and in their hearts and not because of what your last name is. So you don't have to worry about that, but um, you do have to worry about where you're going to live, your transportation, and of course eating. So um, you don't get charged tuition, but you of course have to live. So keep that in mind. Now we're going to have effectively two waves of students because of the nature of school. The first wave would like to be able to start in March okay, of students and part of the team. So if you uh, are not in school this semester or you're able to reasonably take off and you'd like to work from March through the summer, that's excellent. There's gonna be a lot of students out there that will have their summer break and they've already committed to maybe their academic life and such right now for this spring semester. So that's the second wave. So when you apply, remember that. Are, are you applying to start in March or are you applying to start in the summer? And if so, when is that going to be? Now, I, Love the United States, and I'm part of that, you know, obviously here, and I care about my country. However, I care about the people of the world. So, for all you bright young people that are somewhere other than the United States, I am open to having you apply as well. However, it will be important for you to know what it takes for you to be able to come to the United States for this experience, if there's visas, what all that is. 
uh, and also having a sponsor because you will have to, of course, live here, have transportation, eat, and make sure that you can focus on a great academic experience like this. So certainly open to anyone applying from around the world. Um, I just care about people regardless of where you're from. And the United States was founded by people that wanted a better future and life and uh, comes from all walks of life. So that's something that I think is a, a positive of this country. So anyone can apply from anywhere, but keep in mind, you, you gotta get here and be able to do this. I can only get funding so that you can be here right now at this point. Now we're gonna take a smaller number of students. Uh, I'm a little bit flexible, so don't worry about how many that is, um, and just worry about yourself applying. Now, if you do apply, please, one, make sure that you can actually follow through with this because it does take a lot of time and effort on our parts to know. Um, so be fair to yourself, but be fair to all the other students in the organization as well. So keep in mind, we're gonna start in March, or you can do a summer sort of thing. And if you start in March, obviously like to be able to see you go all the way through the summer. We're open to students staying a little later. Of course, if you're able, uh, SEMA, as you all may know, I believe is October. So for instance, if your internship here and the team ends your time, you can of course schedule time to come back later to be part of SEMA and come to that or whatever need events we do with the car together as a team. So there is some flexibility there. Now, uh, with regard to how to apply, and please listen to everything I say because getting all the details right will help speed things along for you. Okay, first of all, go to GeniusGarageRacing.com. That's our website. Our email address is there. You need to apply through the GeniusGarage at Hotmail.com email. Don't, please don't barrage me on Instagram or something like that. It's too difficult. So GeniusGarage. Now, you need to send a resume, of course, with uh, nicely laid out. You don't have to freak out. I'm not gonna be about a certain format. It's all about you. I'm not gonna be that pedantic, but of course, nicely laid out with all of your proper contact, current contact information, all of your experiences, whether that's academic, whether that's work, whatever that may be. Um, and even things are important, like if you were really into rocketry or rail control cars or working on cars, I wanna know what you've done and what you've built. Then the other aspect, of course, is a cover letter minimum of a page, okay? Uh, but you don't have to write me a dictionary, a book, okay? But that's the opportunity, I wanna know a few things. One, why are you a good person, okay? And a good example to come be part of Genius Garage. If we're gonna invest the opportunity in time and effort and resources into you to be an individual for the future, why should we want to do that? And of course, what do you think this experience will do for you that will allow you to go somewhere? So what's your kind of life plan? How is this gonna help you get where you want to go? And what are you potentially doing to do that? Of course, this is a lot of fun. This is a really neat place, but we're here because we're trying to invest in the future of industry and young people. So what are you gonna do with that? That's very important. Any other details that you think are important? Uh, of course, I do care about philanthropic things and people that care about their community. So if you've done some things there where you know, you don't get any credit for it, but you've really put a lot of time investing. Might be nice to hear about that. Uh, just want to get to know who you are and how you think about this. So remember that. Write it all. Find out why. Why is this going to help you? So whether you're in a college somewhere or you're maybe in a trade school or you're working on videography and building things like that, and maybe you want to do documentaries, whatever that may be, let me know. If you're working on cars and you're planning on setting up a shop someday, or you want to be in the racing and motorsports industry, uh, let me know there too, because quite frankly, not only do we have the Lycan build, but there's a lot of other cool things around here. Like here's an Imps the, my Ottoman right now is a Riggins tube chassis Imsa Corvette with 700 horsepower. And this Ottoman over here is a very cool carbon fiber monocoque uh, prototype car that's mid-engine. So, you know, if we have a little time and resources on the side, maybe we should, you know, just be a race team and go racing also. <laughs> I think that's kind of fun. Uh, the Lycan's of course gonna be very exciting. We have, and stay tuned, uh, there's going to be more episodes coming before this comes out, but uh, I have acquired a 2007 Porsche Boxster S that has a naturally aspirated 3.4 liter engine, uh, similar to the 911s from a bit earlier, and it is a great basis and platform for us to cannibalize and use things like drivetrain, bulkhead, suspension, etc., while we build an incredible machine of our own design together. So it's gonna be very exciting. I hope I've covered all the points relating to applying. Please don't barrage me with questions. I think you've got enough. Now, relating to deadlines to apply. It would be very helpful if the first three weeks in January, 
and I can't remember the exact day, but those, that's, that's your window to apply and have the application in, period, okay? If you don't find out about this too much later and it's summer, maybe send it in, maybe that can happen, but that is your window to apply. Sooner is better. Now, don't expect a response instantaneously. There's a fair amount of people applying and a lot going on and a lot that comes from Genius Garage to set this up. So we wanna make sure that we can give everybody the proper time of day. So be patient, it's coming. Uh, don't be afraid to occasionally just make sure it came through or if you have an issue or something's gonna slow you down a little bit, that's okay. But remember, those two things are the way to apply. After you've done that, we'll reach out potentially and uh, schedule an opportunity for an interview either over the phone or potentially a Skype if it's around the world. And we can talk about potential logistics and everything to make that happen. Now, typically when students in the past, uh, such as last year, when students from all around the United States came here to be part of Genius Garage and do this team, uh, there's two relatively local universities close by. Uh, so there are apartments that you can sublet and rent. So that makes it pretty easy in that regard. Uh, and of course, there's lots of good opportunities, Airbnbs, things like that. So generally, it's relatively easy to find good accommodations. This is a nice safe area of the American Midwest, <laughs> which means it can be maybe not the most exciting thing in the world. It's not LA or New York, but it's a good place to be. And also it's very exciting because we're right in the heartland where you can make dreams reality and use what's in your head and your two hands to build something incredible. And this year, I really would like to work with a team of all of you and give young people the opportunity to build their own hypercar, supercar, whatever it is that you want to call it. But I think it's going to be a lot of fun. And I think for all you young people that are going to apply, and even me, the old guy who watched the first Fast and the Furious movie, having a little bit of the uh, cinema magic from those movies and pop culture is fun too. Uh, and of course, um, as some of my students from the past can attest, uh, just because of the nature of collaborating with cool YouTube channels and doing neat things and racing and the people we meet, there's other fun opportunities that I'm sure are going to present themselves through this year uh, to have a little more fun and learn a lot of other interesting things. Maybe go on some travels, have some fun adventures with cars together, and of course have a wonderful year that will be a shining example for your resume and hopefully kickstart a lot of careers. So remember that. Primarily, we're going to have mechanical engineers, we're going to have some tradespeople. If you're really good at welding or machining, maybe you're a car builder and you're gearing up for a job, maybe you want to be in motorsports. If you are somebody who really wants to work on your documentary skills, work on videos, I would like to help give you a platform to do that. Obviously, we're going to be documenting this build and all the students, so it's just so many exciting things to come from this. So please reach out. The first three weeks in January 2020 is when we have to apply. The first opportunity to start work is in May, or excuse me, March. And of course, the second one will come for the summer semesters for students who are in college full time and they need to do that. Uh, beyond that, I'm excited and looking forward to you applying. And um, it's, it's gonna be a truly wonderful 2020 for what I always intended Genius Garage to be from day one is a dream shot. For those really bright young people out there who maybe, maybe they wouldn't have gotten the chance out any other way, but um, the sky smiles, smiles on them a little bit and uh, they get a really neat dream shot. So I'm looking forward to see who the team's going to be this year. But in the meantime, please share this. Let's get the word out there so that these amazing young people can have their shot. And of course, I hope you will like and comment. I'm going to share the documentary on my channel as we go. So subscribe if you're interested. I'll catch you guys next time.